Hi there, guys. My name's Chris. This is my brother, Matt. How's it going there, guys? And welcome to Feed the Beast, the series where me and Matt build a team around any beast player of our choice. We play 10 games. The beast that I'm going for is Ian Robert. And the beast that I'm going to go for is Inform Di Natale. For every goal we score with the beast, we get 10,000 coins. On top of that, for every game that we win, we also get 10,000 coins to build and improve our teams. And after those 10 games, we will once again meet in an epic finale where the loser will do a forfeit. So what team are you on? Team Matt or Team Baba? Leave a so then, welcome. I'm going to be purchasing Informed Draxler first thing in this episode. Because like I say, guys, I'm not going to be buying generic players. This is all about trying new things. So Yes. Um, it's all about Draxler a go. trying new things, not being generic, and being fresh in front of the fresh, the fresh. fresh FIFA army that is out there fresh watching Fresh daily right now. content yeah. is what we so. produce. Even if the player's shit, exactly. I'm going to give them a go. Give them a go because it's different. And guys, if you want to buy or sell Ultimate Team cards, make sure you check out FIFA UT online.com. Description down below for trustworthy and reliable service. That is very professional. Very mate. random, I know. Very professional. So then let's get on with this episode, guys. Yes. Uh, so far, I'm very happy with the team. Like I say, Banse, not All performing over the place. great. Not a great player, Banse. I don't think he's a great finisher. He's not fast. No. Uh, not great at heading. I let's, honestly don't think he's actually very good at heading. Let's anything. set a target, but, mate. Let's okay, guys. Now then, let's set a target. Basically, um, I count to three, and you like this video. It's let's, fairly let's, straightforward. Let's go for 2,000 likes in two hours. Go, go, Yeah, come go. on, guys. Let's nail it. I'm going to count to three right now to get your likes in. One. Two. I'm free. Hit go. that like button. Let's now, before this chats. game, this guy was talking rubbish. This is different. Well, JV. Then it's fucking wonderful. Rainy day, you should play well in rain, right? Time is it now? Call pass, right? Let's get in them. Come on. Come on, you can What's the point? What's the point in watching something you've seen 19,000 times? Come on. Do this, boys. Last game. What are you doing? Are you pausing the game after fucking 30 seconds? Hurry up, you cunt! Uh, giving me a lot of abuse down the microphone. I muted him. I can't be bothered listening to mm, all that. Mm. Sheet. While I'm trying to play the game, okay? I like it's very off-putting. I don't, it's annoying. I enjoy my FIFA in peace and quiet. <laughs> I don't want to hear some... He even turns off the commentator, guys. He has the commentator do, yeah. off. The commentator so all you hear is... That's the crowd, by the way, if, if you didn't notice that. Oh, right. I don't know um, if it helps you, though, mate, but... Uh, yeah, it does, actually. It helps me concentrate. There's nothing worse than the commentators annoying me. So here we go. You've got a bit of an analysis here. He pulls, okay. pulls the defender forward. Time to look at tactics. So, yeah, he pulls his defender Oof. forward. He's sent it back. Look at the space he's left. And now he's right back, tries to cover a bit of the space. And ultimately... Leaves a big, big gap. And that, ultimately, guys, leads to a goal. I think he's and who's on the end of it? There. His defender didn't really make much of an effort to stop Robbe getting no, that then. I, I mean, he could have done better. Who could stop Robbe? But Robbe scored. Robbe. That's the fact of the matter. Robbe. So then, guys, uh, we win that. Very happy. Um, and he quits, actually, on 43 minutes. So the so. guy who claimed that he played well in the rain... Yeah, um, he, he said before the game he plays well in rain. I disagree with that. I don't think he does play well in rain. No, if I, that is you playing well, mate... And I don't think your defence is that bad, mate. No, yeah, no. He, he said my defence is shit as well, didn't he? Mm. Mm. Anyway, Too bad okay. he didn't get anywhere near my defence. Okay, come on then, mate. So then, guys, <laughs> my question my is, what player should I buy next? I'm not giving you a comparison. It's a straight-out question. Who shall I buy next? Uh, please leave a dash, Baba. I'll be looking out for your comments. I'm reading them now. After this video, guys, remember to check out our other video we uploaded this morning. It's a FIFA 14 Ultimate Team interview with a producer down at EA. All the latest Ultimate Team news. Go and check it out. Very good video. Finish watching this video first. Leave a like, leave a comment, and then go and check it out, guys. So then, guys, let's get Team Matt's off and underway. We need a win, guys, because last episode we did get a loss. And uh, we identified centre midfield problems. So I do go in and buy Schneider and Boateng, two people that I have not experienced using in Ultimate Team this year. So we'll see how these guys get on. Um, but I essentially went with these guys purely mainly because of their pace and um, their sort of box-to-box -box things that they will bring to the team because I need people who are going to be fast in with three midfielders, mate. You need to, you know, you need to shift. You need to get a gear on, don't you, mate? Yeah, can I just say, by the way, on, on my mate. go, um, um, I didn't watch the intros. Okay, I didn't watch the intros. Um, I was setting now? up my old my old Gatto device. Yeah. No, because I never actually said that because that guy was having a go at me for watching the intros. I think but you might have said that. I was setting up my old Gatto. I've said it again now anyway on my no, the expense of my go. 
Um, um, we, but anyway, we'll... if, if we get into the analysis here, guys, you can see my theory of the three up top and the three at the back, you know, it's going to, you know, cause equal equations in, and problems for his marking. And as you can see, he's got to force this centre-back here forward to come and mark. And it just pulls him all out of place. And, you know, I've got two options here. I can play the long over the top to Di Natale. Or I could try and do another one too, which probably would have been the better move. But luckily, I do get a little bit fortunate there and still cause problems for this chap at the back. Di Natale finishes home, mate. Di Natale. Oh, mate. He's an I absolute honest, god. I, honest, I honestly think having three defenders can be an advantage. Uh, especially, it can, of course. Yeah. Especially in the Bundesliga. Yeah. Um, because you've got so many good centre-backs. Yeah. I would. Yeah. That's yeah. why I prefer playing three at the back in the Bundesliga guys yeah. because there's that many good centre backs I agree with I'd you I'd rather play three at the back yeah so. it, it definitely depends on what league you're going for yeah it and does, here yeah. I made the mistake of doing it I don't know how I got away with this but bloody hell I got away with it and this guy was good you know in fact this guy was better than the guy look at that you think oh pointless why are you shooting from there that's why I shoot from there because it still causes problems. It still causes problems. Di Natale there. So that's my second goal with Di Natale. But yeah, this guy was good. He was actually better than the guy I lost to yesterday. So, you know, you win some, you lose some. And um, there we go, guys. We Unless do win. you're me, then you just win, win, win. Well, don't get too cocky, mate. Um, so, guys, as you can see here, I have already purchased Schneider and Boateng. I need the third centre midfielder. I saw a lot of people recommending Inla. But I am very uh, torn between Inla and Perlo, but then I see also see a lot of people recommending Valero, so we'll see. We'll see. Leave a comment, guys, and I'm going to pick the one that I see the most off, basically. Leave a comment. Leave a dash mat. I want to see that support. So then, as things stand, I've scored eight goals with Robin. Matt scored eight goals with Dean Atali. Neck and neck. We are even on goals. Um going to be interested in this. My record is 34 wins, no draws, no losses, and I'm on 28,787 coins. Can I get to 40 wins without losing? Keep watching, guys. And my question is, what player should I purchase next? It can be any position. Leave a dash, Baba. Thank you. Yeah, and for the team, match, we are currently on 45,379 coins. We have 28 wins, two draws, and three losses. Guys, what CM should I buy next? Leave a comment. I want to see the team, match support. And guys, were you finished? Yeah. Let's nail those likes if you've not hit the like button Let's already. Let's nail it, chaps. Do it now. Does Arr. that count as clapping, by the way? Doesn't really, does it? Arr. Can I do I'll do that instead. Arr. Okay. <laughs> Who is Adrian it? Olsen, you are chum certified, my chum. Chum certified, true chum, K Pero. K Pero. If you want to be chum certified, guys, leave a like right now. Leave a comment Stop right it. now, and you might be picked for the next episode. It's worth a shot. Give it a go. We'll see you tomorrow, chaps. See, see you later. later. Start a new game and whack it off world class. Computer cheats, can't intercept a pass. Penalty. What was that? Did he just fall? Silly penalty to give away.